This segment will provide some safety, operation, and maintenance tips for your new AgriFab 6-gallon push sprayer. Make sure to read and understand the vehicle manual and the owner's manual before using the sprayer. Never allow children to operate this sprayer. Do not allow anyone to ride or sit on the sprayer. Keep the area clear of all persons, especially children. Read the chemical label before handling or mixing chemicals. Wear eye and hand protection and other protective clothing when handling and applying lawn chemicals. Always release the pressure in the system before filling, cleaning, or servicing the sprayer. Liquid spray material is recommended, as the sprayer does not agitate wettable powders. Do not spray on windy days. Stop spraying when the tank is empty. Using electrical components other than those supplied with the machine could cause the electrical system to overheat, explode, or start a fire. Using the wrong type of battery or charger could cause a fire or explosion, resulting in serious injury. Use the 12-volt charger supplied with the machine, or a 12-volt, 2-amp max substitute charger. Only use the charger in dry locations. Avoid contact with water. Only adults should handle the battery. It contains sulfuric acid as an electrolyte, and the battery is heavy. Dropping it could result in serious injury. Never allow children to charge the battery. The electricity involved in charging the battery could cause severe injury. Examine the charger, its connectors, and the battery for excessive wear or damage each time you charge the battery. If you see any excessive wear or damage, do not use the charger or the battery. Never lift or carry the battery by the cables or terminals. This can damage the battery and possibly start a fire, resulting in serious injury. Lift and carry the battery only by its case. Do not short-circuit the battery. To charge the battery, leave it on the sprayer. Then attach the black negative wire to the charger to the black negative terminal of the battery. Next, attach the red positive wire to the red positive battery terminal. Now, plug the charger into a standard wall outlet. Typically, a full charge takes between 6 and 8 hours. Keep the battery fully charged at room temperature when not using the sprayer. Once the battery is charged, remove the charger from the wall outlet and then remove the connection to the battery. If the battery does not hold its charge under normal conditions, replace it. Purchase replacement batteries directly from AgriFab. To use the sprayer, turn on the pump with the inline switch on the switched wiring harness. Then, squeeze the spray wand's handle to spray. Twist the nozzle to adjust the spray pattern from cone-shaped to a solid stream. When you're done, turn the inline switch to the off position. After each use, fill the sprayer partway with water and pump the water out through the spray wand. Refill the tank about half full of water and a chemical neutralizer solution and repeat the cleaning instructions. Follow the manufacturer's instructions for disposal of all chemicals. As needed, clean the tank strainer on the end of the intake hose. Remove the tip fitting cap nut from the bulkhead fitting. Pull out the screen and flush it with water. Remove the nozzle and flush it with water. For winter storage, drain all the water out of the sprayer, especially the pump and handgun. Winterize the sprayer by pumping a 50-50 solution of water and RV antifreeze through the spray wand. Congratulations! Your new AgriFab 6-gallon push sprayer is now ready to use. For additional help or replacement parts, please call AgriFab at 800-448-9282 or visit www.speedepart.com to purchase replacement parts. AgriFab. Lawn care made easy.